Casa de Lago's kitchen. Um, so you've seen the little uh, clips of the uh, beautiful inside of our dining room. It's just absolutely amazing. Today we're actually going to make a seafood paella. Um, this is just absolutely beautiful. It's got shrimp and scallops and chorizo. We're using a local chorizo. So I'm going to start cooking this right now. So we're going to get the, we use a little bit of extra virgin olive oil. And we use a proper paella pan. So it's got the nice flat um, surface of the paella pan. We're going to add some onion and garlic to that. garlic so it's just uh, basically half an onion some garlic but two cloves of garlic just chopped up we're gonna add our mussels in there these are uh, PEI mussels so they're from uh, Prince Edward Island mussels um, these are an East Coast mussel and then we have our shrimp and scallops and we use a beautiful U10 scallop right here these are a fresh scallop I'm gonna pop that in here I wish everybody had smell of vision because you can smell this at home, it's so amazing. And then this is our chorizo, so we, we use a local chorizo uh, that's coming out of Boise, it's a gin packing company, and they make a bulk uh, chorizo for us. So we put this in here. And we have some roasted peppers, so we have green, yellow, and red. And then we add our rice. So we actually pre-cook our rice in advance. And we add a little bit of turmeric and saffron to it to give it a really beautiful color. We're just gonna stir it, get all those, uh, all that meat in there to start cooking the shrimp and the scallops. So we have lots of really fun things on our menu. Um, we're really focusing on Spanish, Greek, uh, Italian, uh, Moroccan. Uh, so we have a Moroccan lamb ragu, it's just absolutely amazing. Um, we have our paellas, we do a seafood one, and we also do a chicken and chorizo um, paella. And there's lots of other great flavors, lots of Spanish influence. Um, and it's right here on the lake in, in Payette Lake, absolutely amazing. And then we have a little tomato um, stock right here. So we use some uh, nice tomato stock to kind of cook all this together. So we let this cook for about two to three minutes here and let all the, the mussels start to open up. As you can see, they're starting to, to open up wide in there. The shrimp and the scallops, um, all those great flavors. And then we're just gonna add a little bit of seasoning to it. And uh, when I cook, I always try to use kosher salt. I find kosher salt has just a little bit of a flake, a bigger flake, um, and it just uh, adds to um, the flavor a little bit better. It sticks to the sticks to the items, and then a little bit of black pepper. I'm a great believer. You always eat with your eyes when you eat, as well as taste. So you want to make sure everything looks really nice and appetizing with all those peppers. You can see it mix up all that seasoning in there. And then what we do is we just finish cooking this in the oven. And the magic of TV, we actually have one ready to go. So we're gonna pop this in the oven, just so you can see. And then here's our finished, uh, finished paella. So we have chorizo, scallops, shrimp, and it's all cooked in there with that nice saffron rice. And we're gonna add some lovely fresh chopped parsley to that. So if you're up in the McCall area, give us a chance, come in and come and see us here at Regazza de Lago. We have some amazing wines. We got all um, Mediterranean style wines from Israel, from Lebanon, Spain, Italy. Just fantastic wines and really great food. Come see us here at Regazza de Lago. <laughs>